Okay. Now we have the cores. Now we have the cores. And we have 1,800 ducats. I just consider that my insurance policy in case of a war against the Mamelukes. Even if I'm not sure if it will work that way. Let's see. It's gonna be funny. It's gonna be very funny, or maybe not really funny. <laughs> hey, you! Where are you going? Really little sneaky. <sighs> okay, in two years we can attack uh, the rest of the Horn of Africa. Thank you, Ruben. Thank you very much for the for the sub. Much appreciated. Okay, let's try to, to crush them. I mean, I forgot those regions since long time. I mean, it's time to, to annex them. Eh? They're part of our goal. Good. So, first, this guy. So for peace, and let's see if they have money. Yeah, whatever. And then this other guy here. They cannot yet. Ah, okay, wait a second. This other guy here is a different topic because he doesn't have any sort of uh, territory under control, but he has an ally. So you never know. I don't think they will let me take it so easily. Thank you, Franz. Thank you, fa thank you very much for the fourth, mo f fourth month. Yes, it will take a little while. Fine. Let's wait. Unless they don't want to take this territory later on and they just say, okay, you know what, take it, it's okay. No one else can have it there, so let me take the holy site and core it. Kazri Ibrahim. Very good. Let's core this place. Let's core this place. Technology. Military tech. Yes, Archibius. We have enabled the Somnilite Cavalry, the Tuareg Cavalry, and the Barracks. God sidank. dank. Um, thanks, God. Because we need, of course, to update our cavalry. Yeah, good thing. But let's take the Somali. Most important, we have now to build barracks wherever it, it takes. It makes sense. One, two, three, four, five. Good. Now we build a lot of barracks because we need a lot of manpower. That's the, that's the way. That's the way we need to do that. We now produce around about 352 troops per month, which is nothing. We need to do much more. I think I would like, triple it if... I would need to do 1,000 troops per, per month, if, really. No jokes. No jokes. Let's increase also the Diplo tech. And let's continue. Should you use the three Diplo to increase your relationship or to build a spy network? Yeah, that's a very good point. I am building the spy network with um, Adam. And what I could do now is uh, a double claim, that, which I forgot. And the other one we are here, which I also forgot. And now what we do with the rest, uh, we unlock them. I keep always, always one Diplo free because I can need it in wars and, and I think it's enough. But we build the spy network to Merean and Pate. Because here we don't have any sort of mission, I think, so. It's gonna be easier if we have it. Thank you for the idea, Cobb. That was a smart one. Let's build another barrack. Can still be uh, can still be the, the defender of the faith, but I don't know. I don't know, honestly. Okay. Venice says the Italian wars. Okay, where, where can I convert Hara? Soon. But to convert Hara, I think it's easier if... No, I have a church already. Hmm. Okay, another thing I would do is decreasing the autonomy. But with the rebels that I have and the low military, I think I will wait now. I will wait. Like for a few years. Just uh, taking a breath. Um, 
ah, we need, we need to convert it. And for 25 years, we have 10% morale. Okay. Ethiopia, after Khazad Ibrahim, gets a permanent claim on Egypt, which means uh, as soon as the Mamluks are in a war against the Ottoman Empire, we will strike them. We will definitely strike the Mamluks with the uh, higher morale and we will try to get Egypt. So we need to prepare for that war. And we don't have any fort here, I will have to build it. No way, uh, that was a big mistake. Ah, that was a mistake. Thank you, Rob. Tawaro converted the heretics, so now we go to our goal, which is the conversion of Adel. It will take a hell of a time, so... Wow. 0 0.9. It takes so much time. Let me see if I have some ideas, like... Yeah, I have something which will give me just a little bit minus institution spread, but plus missionary. I take it now, just to speed up the conversion. And maybe another idea would be no unrest. This is this guy is useful. Okay, let's look if I can get some discipline instead, because I would change gladly my ad uh, military advisor instead of morale. I would take discipline. Yeah, bad. Let's stop the development here. And here, and also the defense here, I don't need it. On the other hand, I need probably, look at this. Let's take Protect Trade and Protect Trade and also here Protect Trade. Because we have a center level 2. And talking about that, I could improve this to level 2 as well, right? Where is it? Ah, right here. Yes, I could. It would cost me a thousand. But... But... I want to have this man in case the Mamluks attack. Oh, a comet. Thank you, Kobe. Thank you, Kobe. I forgot. There is a, there is a very, very useful uh, addict here. We can use a plus one to convert faster in other. Thank you very much. It was really useful. And that means that now we are going to convert this region in 77, so, yeah, five years. It's okay. Ability. That's important. We have already a large city. We are in two continents. That's great. And we will have also the Renaissance, but we are not going to embrace any Golden Age now. The Justified Wars are amazing. The improved war taxes are also good. I think I would take the Justified Wars so far. <coughs> so... My expansion will be discounted. Let's see. And now let's take the core. I need to convert this area, but first uh, I'm going to create a castle because we are converting the other one. So this area will be easily defendable because this is ter uh, terra incognita. So no one can cross here, and the Egyptians that will try to cross from us one will find uh, a fort in the desert. After Askum, I would like to go Jewish, yes, Red. I would really like to go Jewish after Askum. Aksum, not <laughs> Aksum. Good. I completely forgot. I had some rebels in the south, totally forgot. I was talking and talking and talking, but... The good thing is that my army is almost fully... now... full capacity. Almost. No, it was not that... Not, it was not so long. Wait a minute. Can I take an idea? I think I can now. Let's take the Levin Moss, which will give us the 50% manpower modifier. Also very good. And soon we should have all the barracks, which means, oh yes, 534 men per, per month. Before it was 300. So, 
This is almost doubling up the, the reinforcement rate, which is great. Why go Jewish? Because I would like to, to try the, the mechanics, to be honest. I don't know why. I just find it fun. First I will try out very well the Coptic, because I never played with Ethiopia with the new changes. I played with Ethiopia like five years ago, four years ago. But uh, then Jewish. Or Orthodox. <laughs> no, I don't know. I will see. First I try really to... I would really love to take... Oh, I need so much. I would like really to, to complete this amazing mission tree. Because it's really beautiful. It's really beautiful, really. And then let's wait for the level 7. And then I will fulfill my armies with the cannons. Cavalry as well, but cannons are more important. And then we will attack the, the Mamelukes. Okay, I think I could crush Meran now. Yes, they're allied only with Malindi. Nevertheless, I would really like to see some manpower. Or I attack again with the mercenaries. Thank you, Davide. Thank you for buying Origin on... Uh, on Nexus, where I have the affiliation, that's really appreciated. Thanks a lot. Let's do some investments with this gold. Let's improve our production. Also, that's also important. Let's have some titles now. A lot of gold. Yeah, I think I can afford a war against Meran with uh, only mercenaries, to be honest. Should we do it? Yes, we must do it. Berbera. Uh, Berbera. Malindi and Pate. Pate can be co-belligerent, cool right? They're allied only with Meran. Yes, absolutely. So let me bring here some troops. Let's get ready. Let's get ready for the next war in the Horn of Africa. It has, been a very, it, has, it has been a very, very, let's say, vibrant campaign so far. A lot of wars. That's a lot of fun. Let's build always the barracks to improve our manpower. Where are the... F they don't have any fort. They have only the capital one. Okay. <sighs> Probably we will not need any... We will not need any sort of... Uh, uh, Merc. Ah, and look at this. We have finally summoned power. Isn't it sweet? War. War never changes. Now we have to cross their armies. They have only 13,000 men. Great. Let's not kill too many. Too much. Oh, wait a second. Go back, go back, go back. Those 5k are quite dangerous at the moment. <clears throat> Very good. Good. We're gonna crush them. I think it's gonna be a stack wipe. Let's see. Um, looks good. Looking good. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely good. Very, very good. Buonasera, Pierogi. Good evening, I would say. Good. 
Any question? Any suggestion, guys? Don't remember, don't, don't forget uh, that I'm going to post on my channel uh, this live, okay? I, I will split it in episodes of half an hour and post it every day around, around about 4 p.m. or something like that, um, Central Europe time. But I think that all of us are European. I, I, I'm quite sure that no one is following from the US right now or Americas. Please correct me if I'm wrong. But uh, um, the name of the channel is Ukronia Gaming. Ukrania, if you prefer. I will show you when I when I finish the live in the in the graphics. There is the name of the channel. You can find it, or you can look, go on and do channel and find the, the link. Ooh, this is good. I should have probably picked uh, also Malindia's co belligerent because they have no allied. Uh, that was a very, that, that was a rookie mistake not to check it. Pity. Logitech is in Scotland. Really? But are you Scottish? That's quite good. I uh, Or are you an Italian in Scotland and you know me because you follow me on the Italian channel? <laughs> I don't know. Anyways, uh, greetings to Scotland. Okay. Wait a second. Now something nasty happened. The Mamalax. Mamalax. They just decided that we are bad guys for them. They declared they are our rivals. Which means I'm going to be very careful now, uh, uh, from now on, with the wars I, I start. Because it might be that my army will be needed north. Yeah. You got it. You, under you understood it. So, well, let's try to get the Limber as up, because I will attack only when I will have it, and I need to unlock the... Um, the mission that gives me more morale. Italy, Italy, Italian in Scotland. <laughs> half and half. Half Italian, half Scottish. Okay. That's quite good. What is this? Rampart situation for enemies, local defensiveness. Oh, that would be amazing here. Even if it's not necessary. Come on. Okay, let's try to integrate a little bit of cavalry in our armies and drill. While the rest of the army is fighting south. We'll take all the Horn of Africa. Uh, of course, Pate. Seriously. And no, they are going to convert this province. That's so sad. Ah, no. <coughs> they're already... Uh, they're already Sunni. Then we take also Malind. Uh, the Mamluks are, don't have a lot of strong allies, only an Izami, Drina, Adramut. Let's improve the relations with Aragon because maybe we might be able to, um, to buy a map and meet the Portuguese. I didn't consider this little dirty trick, but it might work. I hope it works. Okay, Pate is down. Wait a second, we are not in a war against Malini. Okay, Malini didn't enter, it's even better. Let's close here. And then let's close us north. Good. <coughs> Sorry. Very good. Very, very good. Very, 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 very good. I could have clicked on core all, but you know, my special, my special ticks. How many men can we still draft? Ah, we are over, we are over budget, fine, two, two units, we can do it. Is it statutory rights? Nope, don't want to do it now. I can start a manufacturing under. 
and one in Vollo. Let's build two manufacturers, which is amazing because it's 1477 we are building manufacturers, having this big, big kingdom. And now if you look at the great powers, uh, what? The Mamluks are not a great power anymore, probably because of the institution, but we are stronger than Muscovy, Austria, Denmark, and Burgundy, which makes me smile, but it's because of the institution. I'm sure about that. Sure about that. Good evening, everybody. So how long will it take? Yes, we have almost converted here the region. And then probably, yeah, we start converting here. Now, let's go and start decreasing the local autonomy where possible. Uh, it will start a huge era, a huge age of rebellions. I don't care. I don't care. Because it's gonna uh, make our economy healthier. And it's gonna help also our, how can I say, manpower. And another thing which will help a lot our manpower is bringing a new culture. Ah, Yemeni and Beya, actually. Nubian is already in, I forgot. Good, good, good. So, this is Ethiopia in 1477. Yeah, we are bigger than the Mamluks. Yes, 60 military power. Love it. Our military tech in two years, we will have the level 7 and we will implement the cannons in our army and then probably we will try to... Let me see if I can buy the maps. Uh, trade foul, uh, take tap, influence nation. Very good. How can I, uh, not really sharing a map? Okay. Anyways, let's now convert lower Nubia. Also here, let's enforce the religious unity. We can take it away from here. And now we use the Mamluks as enemies and the Timur is also... No, the Timur I don't want I don't want them as rival. But what I want to do, I want to insult the Mamluks because I have only 48 power projection. And this will help me. Look, it's scornful. Cost prestige, make it scornful. That's pretty good, that's pretty good. Okay, now, once we have the Coptic faith here, we will unlock a decision, which is this one. Where is it? This one. Morale plus 10% for 25 years. That's a lot, that's a lot. And then we'll also take the nobility. Uh, officer in corpse, general cost minus 25, yearly army tradition decay minus 0 0.5, but we lost uh, army tradition, of course. Tajura Coptic manpower level, have a market placing under. Okay. I'm building a farm estate. Oh, pity. Could take a while. <laughs> forgot I think that the next war is gonna be against the Mamluks I mean I, I don't think I know it it's gonna be against them so we have to keep an eye on those guys because if it happens that the Ottomans will attack them we will strike from the south it's gonna be very bad for them And by the way, let's keep now drilling, 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 drilling. It's very important. Look at look at the rebels. I mean, I have a lot of issues here. I could boost the stability, maybe. No, I don't have enough power. It's better not. Better not. To. Mm. 
very good. Okay. Making Alexandria Coptic again, absolutely. I could get another doctrine. No, I don't need it now. By the way, I think I can move my fleet back. Just take this light ship um, out of that and protect trade in Arden. That's great. How much money are we getting? 19 per month. Wow. Not bad, isn't it? Good. So the conversion is going and going. It will take a while, but uh, as soon as, as this city is converted, then our morale will be good. Um, and the relations with Aragon are very good also. They would not accept an alliance, but let me see if anyone in Europe would, uh, would ally with us. I never got one single alliance so far. Only Karakoyunlu would accept, which is not bad as an idea. But, let's see, I lost, <gasps> no, I cannot believe this, the shitty rebel army stuck white my 18,000, oh no, this was fucking bad, that was such a shitty mistake. I don't even know how it happened because usually they go back if they lose, you know, but the, my goodness, I have no idea what happened here. 6,900 rebels stuck wipe my army, 18,000 men. My bad. <sighs> wow. I take only Kava infantry now, because why not? I think they're very, very expensive to maintain, but it's fine. I don't know, they are Space Marines probably or something. <laughs> Incredible. <laughs> Did you see, guys? <laughs> Welcome to your 4. Yeah, sure, Cobb. You're totally right. You're totally right, man. Yeah, that was really crazy. Okay, let's get now the um, uh, the, 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 the the right technology. I'm going to buy immediately four cannons. There are going to actually five is enough. They are going to fill my army. Sixteen infantry, five cannons, and those guys here they they have the seven. Okay. I had a very low morale, but I didn't know that I could get st stuck white by rebels that way. But it's fine, my, my mistake. Uh, very bad mistake, but... How can I share maps? How can I convince these guys to share maps? Maybe Sardinia can do it better. Let's improve all the relations with, actually, with all the European powers that we have, because as soon as they give me the map of, of Portugal, that's gonna be nice. Incredible. Incredible, really. Okay, now we keep going. We wait for the conversion of Khazar. I think it's better if I steal maps. Okay, let's steal maps in Siena. It's the spy network in Siena. No, but because Aragon now has good relations with us. So. Siena should see the Portuguese uh, without any issue. Independence from the Patriarchy. Okay, wait a second, because now we have a mission. We can get stability or lose stability. An independent church. No, 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 no. we cannot dishonor our Patriarch. Soon we will enter in a conflict against the Mamelukes. Pity that I cannot see um, the Optos. <laughs> I st should steal the maps of the Pope, yeah, that's also fun. Okay, skill, trade efficiency cheaper, let's do it. This guy here. So we get immediately a plus two in, uh, in the Diplo and trade efficiency, which I like. 
and now we take a plus five discipline level two also in the military we can we can maintain them so now we have more discipline okay the, the, the mission to get the permanent claim on Egypt is called take Kazri Ibrahim and we need to take and convert this region and this is exactly what we are doing good We are two units over budget, but it's fine. We have also cannons, we, we are doing well. The only issue that I have is that we have a lot of um, rebels, but it's 1479 and we conquered almost all the Horn of Africa. So, yeah, uh, you know. In one year, actually, we, we, we conquer Ajur and Edogaden. We might do it, probably. Okay, I take another little break. And then we continue till half past 11. So, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for being here. We are trying uh, the run with Ethiopia. I'm going to explain you my strategy, which I stole, <laughs> in brackets. I got inspired by Ludi uh, at Historia. So, I will try to close completely this mission tree. And then maybe convert to Judaism, but let's see. So, I take five minutes of break, probably four. Stay here, don't go away.